past few years, I've really been pushing off doing this job that I want to do, but I don't really want to do, if you know what I mean. But today we're going to get it done. So I'm usually a safety third kind of guy, but this job requires you to be kind of safe. But, hey honey, let's play a game. You know, I don't think my wife is gonna appreciate that joke very much. Sorry, honey. Uh, but on a more serious note, the reason that we're wearing these gloves and we're wearing chemical protected shoes is we're using glyphosate. And if you're, you know, Roundup is just the brand, glyphosate is the, is the ingredient. And what glyphosate is, is, you know, if it's green, it dies. You put it on the grass, dead, flowers, dead, weeds, dead. Anything that grows in soil, pretty much, you spray it on there, it's gonna die. And what we're gonna replace this with, this flower garden, is some MVS seed that I bought off of Amazon. So this is a tall fescue blend, uh, and it's got the Raptor 3 in it, which is one of the highest rated uh, turf type tall fescues. So we have a lot of work to do. As you can see, this thing is really uneven, and there's just, there's a lot of work to do before we can put seed down. So let's get moving. So this is the part of the job where I have to be really careful about what I'm doing, because this is the only sprayer that I have, and this thing puts out some serious pressure. And again, this is glyphosate, so whatever this touches, dead. So I do have to go a little bit outside of the normal lines where this flower garden was because there's a lot of barnyard grass and goose grass, stuff that you can't control without glyphosate. But what I don't want to do is go too far out into the, the lawn lawn and really have to put down a ton of seed because I really don't want to do that this year. That should do it. Now I'm not even going to put this in the grass and it actually dripped on my shoe a little bit so i'm not even going to walk through the grass on the way back you just cannot get this stuff where you don't want it you'll regret that decision real fast you'll see pictures online people that sprayed and then walked through it and then they walk to a different part of their lawn and they have dead footsteps because it's on your shoes and it gets through everything you can't have that so we got our first spray application done and everything in here is not going to die from one application so I'm gonna keep watering this thing every day for the next week. And as stuff, as weeds start to grow, I'm gonna spray it again and just keep killing it. And then we're gonna break out a rototiller, dig this all up, flatten it out, smooth it out. And then we're gonna put down some Mountain View seeds on it. And it's just gonna look like the rest of the lawn. So this is gonna be probably uh, at least one more video on this, uh, probably two actually, um, by the time we get it down and we get the seed down and you know what we're gonna do after that seed and all that fun stuff. Um, so this is where we're going to cut it off today. See you in the next one.